Welcome to Mythic Machines. In this episode, we'll be finishing up getting the floor pan welded in and set up and everything. The show. It's been a while. As you see, things got dirty. But the floor pan's in right now. It's not welded, it's just sitting there. I'm gonna mark it up. All right, I gotta cut up a few more things there. Same on the other side. And then they go under, and I'll mark all the frame. Or I gotta drill all the holes so I can weld it all in after. No, well, down here on the bottom, okay. I'm gonna take my little marker here. I'm going to mark. all around the frame. Okay. Alrighty, the floor is out. And you see, everything got rusted back up again. So I gotta clean all that off. There. And there I made my mark in the back where it was hitting. So I'm just going to cut out this little tiny section there on both sides so the pan sits flat on the back of here. And then I also got my corner right here. And we'll be putting these ones in first. I'm going to clean those out and clean up all the rust and be on it. Okay, so now that everything's all clean off, this right here is the plate that's going to be going right here. As you see, it's quite nicely. Not perfectly, but nicely. Now, see, tabs here have a little holes in them. I made those. That's how I'm going to, well, that's how I'm going to get this to stick there. Is spot welding, so make a bunch of little holes. Normally do that with the drill, but I have a, a punch and flange tool. It work. Take it where you want to hole. Use this one here to make the punch. All in there. And you got yourself a hole. All right, so you can see, made all the spot weld holes I need. Now I can just put it on, and you see, it's not the best fitting, because it's just out of whack. So, I got some self tappers here, normal hex head self tappers. And I'm going to and I'm going to use self tappers to get everything all snugged up and flush. Okay, as you see, I got it all fastened now. I did about every other hole, or uh, what I could do. But now everything's snug together and it's ready to be spot welded. Now I'll do the same on the other side. 
and then I'm ready to weld them together. All right, so you got the same on this side. Plate goes right there. So that's gonna make all my holes in it for the spot welding. Then I'm gonna self tap all the so it's all flush together and it's ready to be welded on. All right, so I'll see you then when I'm ready. Okay, so I got both my side plates there, all mounted, ready to be welded in. Before I weld those in, I'm going to prep the floor pan. You can see where I've traced it. So you can see where all I traced out the frame. So I did a measurement, they're about half. Well, they're three quarters to half inch, so I just marked about half inch, and I'm just going down the center of them. Just staying with that line. I'm gonna be using my, I'm gonna use a center punch, center it, and I'm gonna use a drill bit just to drill it out. So I'll show you. A few, and I'll come back when it's all done. See, that's that one done. Now I'm gonna do that. Try and evenly space them out all the way down, all the way around. Throughout that whole entire portion. Once I get that done, I'm ready for welding. Welding all the spot welds, and that'll be good. So I'll finish this up. And next time you see me, it will be welding. Okay, so all done welding in, all the spot welds on the other side. Now I'm ready to put the pan in. But before I do that, so remember back in a few episodes, our last episode, when I put the pan in for the first time to fit it, make sure everything fit well, I had about a quarter inch gap on both sides. So fix that. I got a quarter bar flat bar, quarter inch flat bar which I'm going to weld into place here, and this will butt up right against my pan. So I won't have that gap in here anymore. Everything will be nice and snug, and it'll be very nice. I would show you welding it in there, but my camera does not like when I weld on camera. It tends to break. So, I got to weld this in. And then I'm ready to set the pan in on both sides. So when I get that done, I'll have the pan in and I'm ready to show you what's next on that. Alrighty, so I got my bars welded in. I'm ready to put the pan in. 
clear everything out of here. Make sure there's nothing going to be in the way. 